Okay, I think it's really important to connect and reconnect the police with the community they're there to protect. It's strong communities that actually can fight crime. And at the moment, I think we struggle to, re to connect the young of our society with the police. I think the young are very much left out. I want to counter this by having youth ambassadors. I want them to not just be there to tell me and to tell the police about the issues that are important to the young. I wanted to, them to also to teach us how to listen. People tell me that it's, it, we have to learn how to communicate with the youth. What we have to do is learn how to listen. Exploitation of, of y young people through the internet is, is a good example or a bad example, if you like, of um, how crime changes. If we want to protect the young from the unwanted attentions of paedophiles, we won't do it by positioning police officers outside schools. That's not where they're at danger. It is in their own homes, it is on their own mobile devices. Um, what we have to do is um, teach or help young people to protect themselves at the same time as making sure that we actually target the, the activities of uh, those that want to exploit the young. That's why Humberside Police have um, a, a unit dedicated to tracking down um, the, ac the activities of paedophiles online and uh, that's a, a really important area but I think your campaign is to be really praised. Um, it raises the issue, um, it's a great example of a local paper that are actually not just reporting the news, they're helping the community to tackle crime and the root causes of crime.